You like it when I play the drums, don't you? <laughs> okay, I won't do that again like I did last time, but hello, I am Bonnie Smith for Shop and Show Live. I am here in Paper Wizards Studio B for Bonnie. You got that right, yeah? <laughs> and we are live in Orem, Utah, bringing you the Shop and Show Make and Take Goodie Box for the November Shop and Show event. Now, as you all know, the Shop and Show event is November 19th, and in this box, there are over 20 make and takes and so many goodies, wait till you see. You guys, you're just gonna be in heaven. <laughs> There's a crafting heaven right here. Um, I, I, I wish I could see your faces when you saw, see some of these. They are fantastic. I think everybody has just knocked it out of the park. You know, if I do say so myself, um, I'm so humble. But remember a few things. Number one is there will be a schedule included with your box so that you can know when all the make and takes are happening so that you're sure to watch those. Number two, shipping is included with your box. And wherever we can, we ship UPS. Um, a few places like, you know, APO, I can't, it has to go USPS, but it'll be priority and it will be expensive, <laughs> but that's not your concern, is it? But you'll get it. It's free and we will make sure that you get it and we will have tracking and we will get it all out to you. For first timers, we ship the boxes all at the same time. So you don't order it tonight and receive it this weekend. We will ship them all starting the first weekend of November and to make sure that they're at your residence or wherever you order them for and make sure they're there on time. If you are ordering more than one box and yes, you can order more than one box. What? I know we didn't used to do that, but we kind of, we let you do that now. Shh, don't tell. Okay, tell. They will be shipped in the same box because that helps us out. Should we tell them what we're what the technology we're using tonight? The technology we're using. The, oh, okay. So, <laughs> so he he's very fond of rubber bands, and we are simulcasting on the Paper Wizard scrapbook page as well as the Shop and Show Live group page with his phone and my phone rubber banded together. That's how we accomplish that feat. High tech. Nobody will ever accuse us of being too techy. <laughs> wait, wait. We tried the chip clip, but that didn't... No, you, we did not. You. I said no to the chip clip. I knew that wasn't going to work. <laughs> Usually Cooper, the intern, who is now, you guys, Cooper the graduate. Oh! Usually he is here to help us film, but he neglect, we've neglected to inform him, and he didn't get the night off of his other job. So he's at work. We're here. Eric has two phones rubber banded together with the rubber band just like this one. So if something goes way wrong, work. if something goes way wrong, that's why. Ooh, hey, Alex gotcha. You almost hit your cameraman. <laughs> well, it's just a sign of love, baby. That's it. Okay, what else do we need to tell them? Oh, immediately after the live reveal oh, unboxing. The box will be ready for sale. Ready for, for sale. Purchase. And we'll put the links on both pages, both pages, including some Plus other pages. Plus a few other pages, just because. Um, I'm trying to think. There's, there's more stuff. Hmm. You don't want me to open the box, do you? Let's do it. Let's do it. Wait. This is my sexy zebra stress knife. Seriously, that's what they call it. I got it from Uline. It's called sexy zebra strap knife, or snap knife, because it snaps off when it gets done. Who can argue with that? Why would you argue? It's sexy, right? I don't even know. Do I still know what sexy is <laughs> at my age? <laughs> Let's not answer that question. Let's just keep opening the box. How about we unbox it? Let's unbox the box. Okay. Ooh, ah. <laughs> okay, oh. Should we show them the promo item first? Yeah. Let's start off with a splash. Okay. Ta-da! Your promo item. It's a box. Anybody guess? <laughs> it's a box inside a box. It's a Shop and Show Funko Isn't Pop. It the, it, yeah. That would be old. Oh, That'd be a great idea, actually. That'd be a great idea. But who would we make it of? Queenie. <laughs> Queenie. Queenie. Yeah, she'd go for that. All right. So, speaking of Queenie. Hi, Queenie. 
Um, shop way, and show live events. Look at that. Just come close. This tumbler is coming in all of the boxes. Do, 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 do. And it's it's super cute. It's a nice it's one. Super fun. It's Queen and Company Pink or Shop and Show Pink. And we love it. It's you know, I've already got people saying, if you have extras of those. Can I have one? So each box will contain one of those. Yes. Absolutely every box. free. Absolutely free. Now we're going to start with, oh, be creative. Okay, so be creative. Now, this is a deceptively simple make and take. And you know what? I need more room. I'm going to move this forward and move this to the side so that I can show you. So, this is a darling little card. It says hello. It has striped paper, it has some foil paper, that magenta. And she's gonna teach you a little foiling trick. Uh, can you see that or is it glaring? Um, let me come to you. Okay, come to me. And you can see here that you're also getting a bunch of these crystals too. So you're gonna learn a new technique, you're gonna make a really cute card, and you're gonna get a bunch of, of fun little crystal stickers. Look at all that. So this is Be Creative. KB. That is your first project. KB. <laughs> well, I guess we'll set that. I'm not going to have enough room by the end of this. It's going to be super crowded, but that's a good thing, right? Oh, oh, here's a paper wizard item. One of ours. We know how you guys love Christmas lights. So we're going to have this Christmas lights title. And now I put it on a backer so you could see it better. It won't be on a backer when you get it. But that is the title, and this is what you get. And there will be a companion layout to purchase on the website, not until the day, not, well, maybe the day before, we'll see. Hopefully we'll get it all loaded on the 18th, but not until the event starts, really. And as a reminder, whatever we do is exclusive to Shop and Show as far as make and take script. Yeah, we, we don't, this is not going to be sold. There's one item that we're doing. It's a, an extra, though. We brought that in just because we love everybody. Yeah, that's a, that's like a little kiss me. Yeah. My mother used to call it a, it's a little kiss me. She was right. It's a little kiss me. She knew you had lots of kiss me's when you were young. Well, they did call me kissy for merch. That's what I'm saying. I was three. It didn't mean anything. Very lovey-dovey and affectionate. What can I say? Oh, this is one of my favorites. This, well, okay, I just reached in and I grabbed another paper wizard. So here we go. This is We Wish You a Merry Christmas Tree, Word Tree, Christmas Word Tree. And it uses the My Mind's Eye Glimmer paper. So it is really pretty. And again, I put it on a backer just so you could see it um, very clearly. But it will not come with a backer. It will come like this with instructions, and we will have a little, maybe this should be the one Cooper the Graduate teaches. Maybe. Maybe. But when they put that together, yeah. it's gonna look even better than that. Well, here's the fun part. You can add some crystals to this if you want to, or a little bit of like stickles, sticklers. Um, you could also put it on a card, and it would be a really pretty card. Make sure you love the person a lot because, you know, value. And it will be perfect as an accent on a Christmas page. So you can, there's so many different ways to use this. I feel like, that's gonna hold it, there we go. I feel like you've got a lot of options there. So that's that one. Ooh, okay, this one's one of my favorites this time. I love these little dies from Tall Mouse. So this is the 321 Snowflake card and you have a couple options. So, these are your options to make. I believe you're gonna be making one of them, but if you'll notice, she gives you the printout for both. You get to choose, and honestly, I think you can make two. I think it would be very, very easy to make two. Look at, the, look at all the glimmer, or the crystals. Look at all the bling. And you get these dies. So you can make this over and over and over again. You can change the colors up. You, I mean, this this is a more of a value than we asked for to, uh, from our vendors. Just so you know, she went uh, above and beyond the contract just because she loves you guys and she's happy to be back because Tall Mouse missed out last time and we missed Tall Mouse last time. And they're back. So 
We love Tall Mouse Creative Arts. Jim and Kim. Jim and Kim. So we'll put that one right here. The dynamic duo. The dynamic duo right here, and we'll put that's going to get covered. I wonder if go. I wonder when she does her segment, if she'll give us a tour of her house again. I wonder if she'll have those good chocolates again. Ooh. I bought some of those last year. Ooh. They made great Christmas presents, and when I forgot to give one away, they made a great snack. Yep. Yeah. Kim has a habit of walking through her house, which is beautiful, and she has part of her presentation in each of the rooms. Okay, so we have something fun here. These are Thanksgiving place cards. You will receive six. When you look at the picture online, you may not see all six of them. There are six. Let me show you. And they are so cute. Aww. And they come with these little flaps on the back, so they stand up. Wait, which one was that? That's a chef's hat. Okay, we've got the chef's hat. Let me show you the pilgrim hat. And then we have another chef hat. And another pilgrim hat. And another pilgrim hat. And another chef hat. <laughs> All right, six, and I can't tell how they look to you because I'm behind them, but they're super cute, super fun, great for the kids' table or your table, and let me give you a little sneaky trick. Because there are six of these, and if you need more, what you can do is you can go every other plate and then do leaves or something else in between so that it covers your whole table. We usually have about 12, so I'm lucky, I know the maker. <laughs> so I could probably get 12. But I, we also have some other pretty pumpkins and stuff like that, so you can go every other one so that they will be all over your table or the kids' table. Super cute. And as you can see here, there's a place to write names. Or you could even have people write what they're thankful for. Either way, or both, it's all good. So Thanksgiving is making an appearance at Shop and Show this year. How about that? That's a new one. Okay, ooh. This is beautiful. This is Stamplistic. Jennifer has outdone herself again. As you know, she's quite talented. And here is the finished version that you'll be making with Jennifer on November 19th. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. And it is a card, but honestly, I almost want to frame this. I'm thinking, frame, I don't want to give it away. <laughs> so that is something that you will be able to decide for yourself. Frame it, give it away, keep. There we go. Actually, is that going to fit there? Eh, we'll go with it. We'll see what we do. See what we see, right? Oh, okay. Here is the Echo Park 8 by 8 double page layout, so 8 by 16. Now, you're getting 12 inch paper, so if you don't want to make it 8 by 8, you don't have to. So, but we have the 12 by 12 paper, and we have a sample. A sample. Oh, and then I should say, it's not all 12 by 12 paper. The maroon or wine colored paper is eight and a half by 11. The orange paper is 12 by 12. And then you'll get a piece of the leaf paper and such for that. So you'll have a lot of fun with that. Plus you get the entire thing of ephemera right here, which has a lot more pieces on it than we've even showed here. So you can have more uses for it. So that is a Paper Wizard Echo Park collab with most, mostly Echo Park. <laughs> I just got to design it because, you know, paper. Ooh. And Madison and Milo had a little meeting today, didn't they? Yes, I had to go pick up, some, in fact, some of the paper for this kit and for uh, some PKC kits today. And Echo Park's just a, like four miles away or so. And Milo, Milo is with me. For those of you who know about Milo, he's our puggle. He is 14. He is a little grumpy old man. <laughs> and he's getting a little anxious, so we try not to leave him alone too much. Maybe for an hour or so at the time, but even, even so, it's hard on him. And so he got to go to Echo Park and meet Madison and the crew. 
<laughs> and he didn't care as long as he could see me. So yeah, I'm his person. He's not my, he's supposed to be my son's dog, but I'm his person. Okay, here's the freebie we talked about. We, we looked at everything and we wanted to do something nice for you guys. You've been supportive all through COVID and even after the pandemic and you still love the Shop and Show box. So we thought we'd give you an early Christmas present and that is our 2022 Ornament Gem Christmas title. Now this is something that you will see us sell. This is not exclusive to the box. Just to be clear, totally transparent and this is what it looks like. And that's not a make and take, that's just a this gift. This is not a make and take, this is a gift. It's literally a so Christmas here, present yeah. from Paper it's Wizard. It's literally a present from Paper Wizard to you. Check out the glitter though. Boom, baby. So we're gonna put that, I am running out of, I know I have more, I do. Yay me. What's the retail on that, do you remember? Uh, $8.99. Okay, so there's nine bucks. Honestly, you know what? With the current prices, it should be $9.99. Let's just be honest. I'm gonna put it right there. I'm, I'm running out of space and I haven't even gotten to everything yet. All right, now we have the two page layout using PhotoPlay and My Colors cardstock, PhotoPlay paper, and it's from Inspiration in Bloom by Abby Heckman. And I think this is adorable. It's unexpected, which is one of my favorite things. The bright blue and kind of some of the aqua tones in here, the snowflake paper. Um, actually, I, I adore this snowflake paper. And the, the flags, the pennants, the upside down Santa. It's, like, very, it's very playful. It's very playful and it's so much fun. And look at, even Santa's having, Santa gnomes over here, having trouble keeping the car on the road too because they've got too many presents on top. Yeah, that's what it is. <laughs> it's not the eggnog? No, no, never. And then it has holiday memories, so you have a little journaling block. You've got lots of room for pictures. I feel like you could add a few more pictures in here as well. So I feel like this is, there's a lot in here that you can do a lot with. So this will be fun. And I'm gonna put that right here and hope that it stays up. There we go, and I don't knock it over with the box. We're gonna need a bigger table next time. I keep telling you that. Oh, and this project, oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, so Doodlebug makes the cutest advent calendar paper. And we decided we wanted to do a little advent action with you this year. And so these, you get the paper and then you get all the pre-cut tags. See, see these? Say what? Pre-cut tags. There's lots and lots, 25. And you get a two, I think that's a two or two and a half inch ring two inch ring and as you can see you need that because it fits nicely and you can write memories on here or you can actually do an advent calendar so that every day of the month you can hang this by you know in your kitchen your command center and you can command center command center baby come on and you can write here go Christmas caroling bake cookies watch a Christmas movie elf Watch another Christmas movie. Send Wiz, send Wiz Christmas cookies. Send Wiz Christmas, do not send Wiz Christmas cookies. He's trying to strengthen his core. <laughs> I sold you out. His physical therapist said so. But that, and we're gonna show you another way to do this too, using a, um, in fact, I'll post it. In case you wanna put this like on a board, you can put this on one of those 20 by 30 white foam core boards and hang it up. And then you can add ribbon to it if you want. You can do all sorts of fun things. So that is this. And we will do this during the Doodle Bug segment on Shop and Show. We would have a sample of that anywhere, would we? The board? I do, but I can't get to it because I'm blocked in here. Really? It's, it's over there. Oh. <laughs> so maybe in a minute. Let's see. Oh, okay. So here's the one. The paper wizard one. This is our All Aboard Express. Single page layout. And yes, there will be a companion page to this gorgeous layout. Check this out. I have used beautiful brand new paper from, I want to say The Magic of Winter is the name of the collection, but I'm not sure. It's, it's Echo Park. And it is stunning. And the first thing I thought of when I saw this paper was Polar Express. 
I went, oh, 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 we have to, we have to. So we did all aboard. We have your express tickets over here, the little train track here, conductor cap with the obligatory holly, right? And a jingle bell. So, and then we have snowflakes and we also have some gemstones here. So can you see that? I'm gonna bring it up close so that you can see it. So we will make this together and we will Actually, I'm going to put that here. Wait till they see the add-on page. When they see the add-on, if you, you guys... If you like that... Chugga, chugga, choo, choo. Wait till you see the add-on page. We think. It's in my head right now. <laughs> it's on, I, I scratched it out. Yep. I can't draw, so you guys, I draw little stick figures, and I sketch stuff out for the design, and then he turns it into magic. So that's how we work. And, of course, Simple Stories is back with one of their simple card kits. And you get eight cards here, eight, eight. And they are so cute. And you know how they have fun with their colors at Simple Stories. So these have a little bit of almost like a wood tone. There's a gold. Look at this. Let's get Santa out there. And you can see we've got everything you need is in there. And it's like you just pop it out. There's no fussy cutting. It's just all cuteness. And there will be pictures of all eight of these. Look at the cute little reindeer on that one. Amber's something, isn't she? She is. She's phenomenal. Oh, and there's a rumor there might be a new collection from Doodlebug. So that'll come too. But I know there's some new collections from Simple Stories, and they're going to show you on the 19th. You're nice. I love that one. Oh my goodness! It's a like it's like a gingerbread or wood snowman. I think that's my favorite. That's very cool. <laughs> I love it when they do something unexpected. That's cute. And they're all very textural. They're all like you know, the the gloss on the hearts here, and just the fun. It's just it really looks like you sat and labored for. How many are there? Again? Eight. Eight. Wow. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 So, yeah. And that is a great product. I'm really excited about it because um, I'm going to buy a box, too. So, but I'll wait and make sure everybody else gets one first because charge, I'm kind. I'll charge you double. <laughs> you charge, you got to charge me double, you guys. Okay. No, I know people. <laughs> so do I. Hey, Kev. <laughs> Amber. <laughs> Jana. Jana. That's who we need to talk to. Jana Eubank. Oh, we're getting to the goodie box portion. So we have all the make and takes out there everywhere. For um, those interested, how many make and takes are there? If we counted? I think, I want to say 23. If you count each, like eight cards from Simple Stories, two okay. cards from them, six of these. I didn't count this as 25 because, come on. That's a little much. This is one. So, but there's almost two dozen. Not quite, but almost two dozen make and takes. Do you know what? So, I have an idea. Why don't I do some close-ups while you go over there and grab that board? You, want me, you guys want to see the, well, don't they want to see the goodies, or should we do the well, board? We can just, the board. Right, I'll grab the board. It's out of reach. You do some close-ups. So, this is planned. This is part of the script. Yeah, this, this was planned. All right, so this was an idea I came up with for those of you who want to like have an advent calendar that's basically hanging up. And you can punch holes here and here, put grommets in them, tie it up with a ribbon if you wanted to. I just got this foam core board at Hobby Lobby. And actually I was lucky, I got it on sale this last week for very inexpensively, it was $1.99, usually it's more. And then you, what you would want to do though is find a way to keep these closed. So like a little tiny piece of Velcro would work. I'd get a little white Velcro button and I think that would be perfect. Because if you put anything else on there, it's gonna tear. I'm gonna go through those real quick because they're really cool. Well, it's all Cynthia's art. Yeah. And it's super cute, super colorful. You know me, I love my doodle bug. I love the colors. Look at this little polar bear with look, look, look. the best. If you lift it up a little bit, I'll get that bottom row, baby. Yeah. There we go. 
Look at the penguin. So, but you like that big side at the bottom? We just don't want to mislead you. Ribbon's not included, the board's not included. What you will get is this. So, but you can make other things besides that. You can make this with it. That's a miscommunication in the past. Well, I just don't want anybody not to understand. I want to make sure that they know. I don't want them to be disappointed. I want you to be excited, not disappointed. Disappointed is sad. Excited is good and fun. Okay. So we said over 20 make and takes. There are 23 at last count, looks I like. I want to say 23. Okay. I could be wrong. It could be 24 or it could be 22. That's why we said over 20. Over 20. Well, and there's one that's kind of a make and take and kind of not. Scrapbooktree.net has, um, this was a little last minute addition and they are giving you this and it makes, I gotta find it. It's another Thanksgiving-y one. It will make this. Wow, that's cool. Not the white circle, just the pumpkin. Look at that. But it does not include like the glitter or the little, you know, crystals. But you will get all the pieces to make that and she can show you how to make that during their segment. So it's like an add-on make and take. So maybe it is 24 now, because this would certainly qualify. And she sent me this, and again, I just received it. So she's going to be showing you this during, and this is where it goes. It's a beautiful page. This. So you can buy the companion layout from scrapbooktree.net when they do their live. So that's kind of fun because that was unexpected and, and when it showed up, I was kind of like, this is gorgeous. And Shannon does such beautiful work. If you guys aren't aware or if you're not accustomed to seeing scrapbooktree.net, this is only their second appearance on Shop and Show. And I found her at the Great Lakes Mega Meet and I walked through her booth, I kid you not like this, And then I met her and I said, you need to be on Chop and Show. And she said, okay. <laughs> it was that easy. But that will not be in the group photo. This is not in the group photo because it just arrived yesterday and the photos were shot over the weekend. And the photos were shot by the inimitable Megan Hefner. And for those of you who know, if you know, you know, right? Megan's a former creative editor of Creative Keepsakes Magazine. And she is a phenomenal artistic talent. And photography, her photography is beautiful. It's perfect, it's wonderful. And that's not even her best talent. I think it is, but she's got a lot of talents. So, all right, let's get into some of the goodies. You've already seen the Shop and Show Tumblr. Where do we put it? I'll put it over here. But, okay, so this is the fun one. Queen and Company. Scored. Scored. You guys, she must love you. This is all I can say because one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, oh, there's eight. I'm missing one. I must have dropped it. There are eight of these. These are little rice. Oh, there they are. It's just stuck together. All eight are here. You will either get eight rhinestones or eight pearls. And what, and what's the retail set. value of that set? $24.95. Per person? Yeah, per person. I'm like... She sent us She sent us the invoice. I know. The retail price was like, really? Wow. Yeah, no, it was it was insane. And so, and look, all oh, the pearls. You guys, you could use this for Christmas. Ooh, this one will match that layout really well. There's red, there's green, there's yellow, there's, oh, there's pink. So you will either get pearls or rhinestones, one of each, or not one of each, either or. You know what I'm so really- So you'll get eight. You know what I'm really sure of? What are you really sure of? They love Queen and Company. Well, yeah. I love Queen and Company, come <laughs> on. <laughs> it's like, I have a little drawer. <clears throat> it's not a drawer, it's a big bin filled with some Queen and Company stuff that I love. So that's a goodie box item, if you would believe. That's a goodie box item. $24.95, you guys. Holy cow. Now, we also have, and these are the cutest things. There are these foam stickers. So as you can see, they're thick, 
and there's glitter on the top of a couple of them, and there's two different styles, same value. So you will either receive the Santa, who's jolly, or the Merry Noel. So you'll get one of these two in your box. And, oh, this one. Okay, so this will be fun because this will match the photo play layout. You will get one of these six by six Christmas patterned paper pads for Tula and Norbert's Christmas party. And if you have an ugly sweater competition, there's that in there. There's, oh my gosh, there's so many things in there. It is, look, oh, cuteness. Okay, so this one's mine. I'm just gonna, I don't know what you're talking about, dear. And, <laughs> okay, it's gonna fall out and get dented. We can't have that. Uh, let's put that up there. And we've got some more bling because there's never enough bling at Christmas time. So we've got some fun red bling for you. And then, oh my goodness, we have cute little Christmas tags. These are kind of oh, Victorian are cool. old fashion. Look at those. Yeah, these are very cool. Oh. And they're they're thicker too. They're they're dimensional a little bit. Plus they have some crystals on them and little tiny ribbons, which are really cute. The little tiny strings. I said ribbon, I meant strings. Sorry guys. So you could actually use these as tags. I see them kind of going down the side of a scrapbook page or taking center stage on a card. I think you can do a lot with those. And then we have, for everybody, one doodle bug, doodle pop. Now, you won't all get the same one. I've got this guy, and I've got this tree, and I think there's one or two others. So it'll be guesswork. But you can, you know, trade them like trading cards. Oh, I already have the gingerbread man. I like the tree. Oh, I have two trees. Here's a, see, you can trade with your friends. Oh, and this, this is one of my favorite goodie box items because, and we have to thank Kim at Tall Mouse for helping me get these. These are cute little bottles of glitter and little snow and little beads. Now there are three different colors. There's white, there's gold, or there's silver. Okay, so here's the gold. Ooh. Yeah, I, I'm a gold person, I like the gold. And for Annie Miller, here's the silver. And that's kind of a silver and white cool on too. that one. Yeah, you know what, they're really all cool. I, I don't think there's a bad one, I don't know which one. If I were getting a box and I could choose, I'm not sure which one I'd choose because they all have different applications. Um, if you live in the snow, if you decorate with red and gold and green, like I do. If you decorate with silver, like Annie does. <laughs> so, lots of fun stuff. You can put these in um, the little shaker windows and shaker boxes and fun stuff like that. Plus, I think they'd just be sitting so cute in the little tiny bottles on one of your little shelves in your craft room. Sometimes it's just decor that, you know, you don't have to use it. Sometimes you just get to look at cute things. <laughs> okay, but you should use it too. Or not. I think, I think, we're to the bottom of the box. Wow. Yeah. So. So what's the value, you think? Over $175. Okay. Yeah, easily. Over $175 when you add in all these extra. We have, we have some goodie box items here that, well, hello, Queen, that really blew my mind on the value. And so it really bumped up the value. Plus, it, <clears throat> it's making the box heavy. <laughs> so with a heavier box and a higher value, and um, I do believe that this is a really good value at $119.99. Including shipping. And that includes shipping. And it, it'll be shipping via UPS unless we can't ship at UPS. There are some areas that we will have to use the Postal Service. So, and keep in mind, um, they do tend to go fast, but if we don't sell out right away, make sure you get your order in as soon as you can to make sure that we get these shipped out to you in time for Shop and Show Live on November 19th. So, I'm Bonnie Smith, and this is, ooh, Happy Crafting Chaos. And how do they order? You order on paperwiz.net. There's no code needed. The free shipping will be given to you when you check out. 
There won't be any issues there. And um, the one thing we will ask is just order the box by itself because other items will slow it down. So please just order the box if you want the box. It'll be free shipping and we'll get that out to you before November 19th. And if link's not already posted, we will post it as soon as we... We will post it as soon as we save this and post this on the pages. And if you have any questions, just email us, give us a call. We will be happy to help you out. I'm Bonnie Smith for Shop and Show Live. I hope you like all these projects because I really feel like our vendors really brought it this time. So... I, I want to say Happy Halloween, but no. Merry Christmas! <laughs> ho, ho, ho. Thanks for joining us.